Hi ladies, it's Mara Lewis here. I'm in Phoenix, Arizona, and I'm really excited to spend some time with you this evening. Welcome to Melissa's Mary and Martha event. Um, this is a new thing for me doing videos, uh, and actually Mary and Martha's new too. Um, but uh, I'm out here in online land, and I want you to get to know each other and to get to know Mary and Martha. And so I'm just putting it out there, and I'm just going to talk to you for a couple minutes and show you a couple things, and then we just want to have fun together. I want to have fun at Melissa's home. We want to have fun online. Uh, I am here to show you some fun stuff, answer any questions you have, and basically just facilitate some fellowship um, with the wonderful ladies. So welcome. I um, want to thank Melissa for hosting this party. I've known Melissa for several years now. We both lived in Madison, Wisconsin. Um, and Melissa was the daycare teacher in my daughter's room um, for about a year. Um, so she's loved on my kids, which is amazing. And she's been um, a really important influence on them. Um, and she knew me at a time in my life in Madison where I was running a lot. And actually, I'm trying to do that again, which is why I look like this. Um, so just forgive the sports bra. Um, <laughs> and um, I think some of our mutual friends have been invited to this party. So so, um, friends in Madison, welcome. I hope that you're all having a good time. And I miss Madtown like crazy, um, but we're enjoying the desert life here. So, anyhow, let's get started. So, what have you heard of Mary and Martha? Chances are you probably haven't. Uh, Mary and Martha is a Christian direct sales company. So, like Mary Kay or Avon, we only sell products through consultants. Um, and we are owned by Dayspring, which is also owned by Hallmark. So you may not have heard of Mary and Martha, but you certainly have heard of Hallmark and the products that you'll see today come with that quality. They come with the mission of you know, facilitating an experience, being a gift, uh, being a blessing to someone's life. So if you've gone to church or you um, have read the Bible, um, you probably have heard of Mary and Martha. And no, this is not Martha Stewart. Um, this is Mary and Martha, sort of the original hostesses with the mostest back um, in Jesus' time. They entertained Jesus, and Jesus frequently went to Mary and Martha's house for fellowship and to gather at the table. Um, and we know that Jesus went there because he enjoyed that bonding and that experience. Um, and so there was one particular story in Luke where it's one of the more famous stories with Mary and Martha. Martha is hustling and bustling in the kitchen and getting everything ready. You know how it is, ladies. You got to make sure the timing is right and the dishes are going to come out. And Mary is in the living room at the foot of Jesus and is just worshiping him. And she is totally in the moment. She's loving God, you know, and Martha's in the kitchen and she's like, mm, this is, this isn't cool. I'm doing this all myself. So she goes into the living room and she's like, you know, Jesus, can you tell Mary to help me out here? Like I'm doing all the work. And Jesus says, you know, Mary's got the right idea here, Martha. You need to relax, you know, and it's okay. Um, and so frequently there's this idea of Mary versus Martha that, like, we shouldn't be hustling and bustling. We shouldn't be serving others, that we should just worship God. And, and actually what we're trying to do here, and I think what is the right message, is that we need to find the balance, ladies. We need to love God and love others. And part of love is service. And part of love is hospitality. Even when we don't want to open up our homes because there's two inches of dust on the windowsill and we haven't vacuumed in a month. Um, you know, there are people out there who need to be loved on and need, who need to be blessed and need to be prayed over. Uh, and that is our job as Christians to open our homes um, and to be hospitable. And so Mary and Martha, the idea is that our products are meant to facilitate that meaningful experience that um, when we get together, the products have a saying on them. They have a verse on them that reminds us the true meaning of hospitality, but they're also fantastic gifts and that each of these items, when they're sitting in your homes, they're on your wall, they're being used, um, they're lighting up your home, um, that they're serving as a silent witness to God's grace in, in your home and in your lives and in your friends' lives and your family's lives. So 
there's lots of amazing stuff in the catalog and I really encourage you all to look through. I'm here to answer any questions. So if you're sitting in Melissa's house and you're just hanging out and having a great time, just fellowship and love on Melissa. Love on Melissa and Matt as they set up their new home. Um, and, and this is a bit of a housewarming. So we're very excited um, to give some lovely um, hostess gifts to Melissa. Uh, and I just encourage you to remember that, um, that giving is, is a great joy. So a couple of my favorites I've got hanging out behind us here. Um, the special this month for the ladies who are buying on Melissa's party is a BOGO, which is a buy one, get one. Um, and so for $65, you buy one set of the new Hospitality on the Go line in fall colors. And for $15 more, you can get a second set. So it actually equals 80 pieces of foil bakeware and food trays and cups and all kinds of really amazing stuff for fall entertaining and football parties and potlucks. Um, for $80. So 80 pieces for $80 a dollar piece. So we've got those back here. I don't know if you can see them. I've got different colors. We've got foil, bakeware, pans, and trays. And so you'll find that in the catalog and also uh, I'll be posting online. Um, and then a couple of my favorite items here. Um, you can probably see I had flowers from this weekend because I did some, host some, some hosting of my own. This is the Grace and Gratitude collection. This is ceramic white heirloom uh, pitcher. This is the Queen Anne's lace pitcher. Um, these pieces are just, they're, they're gorgeous. This is actually one of the reasons I signed up to be a Mary and Martha consultant. They're just fantastic pieces. Um, this is, you know, a great wedding gift. This is a stunner on your dining room table. It's amazing to serve your orange juice at brunch. Uh, flowers, as you can see, are really lovely. It's, it's one of my favorite products. Um, and then I have also one of our new little products, which I just adore. These are the tea lights, uh, tea light shades. Uh, it's just the shade. This is actually just, you can see, it's just a wine goblet. And I threw a little LED light in there. Um, and then you put this on, you turn your LED on, and you have just a really amazing atmosphere right there. Um, these little guys come in sets, I believe, of six uh, or three. There's different sizes, um, and I'll, if you have questions, we'll find it in the catalog for you off the top of my head. I can't remember. Um, but different colors, different sizes, um, really, I think $20 um, for a number of them. And you can line up on, on, your, on your bar, on your table, and create a really lovely atmosphere. I think it's a really unique piece for fall, for Thanksgiving. Um, and for entertaining. So anyhow, so that's just a couple of things that you'll see in the catalog. Stay tuned for more. If you're on the Facebook event, make sure that you hit refresh often um, so you're not missing anything. Comment, tell me what you like, um, enter for prizes. There's a couple of giveaways um, and let's just have a great time, ladies. So uh, welcome, sit back and enjoy.